Yeah, you got that yummy, yum, the yummy, yum, the yummy, yummy. Yeah, you got that yummy, yum, the yummy, yum, the yummy, yummy. Hey YouTube fam, it's your girl Gladys and welcome to Is That Your Hair? If you're new here, be sure to tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. And if you've been rocking with me for a minute, what's up, what's good, and welcome back. Today is $20 Tuesday. $20 Tuesday is a special time on my channel where I showcase super cute yet super affordable wigs for the lovely $20 price range and below. So let's just dive right in. I haven't worn a fro like this in a long time and I'm super excited to share this with you all. This is a wig that I bought from Amazon. I've seen it for various prices, but it normally ranges anywhere between $25 to $27, which I think is an awesome price for this wig. Now, I know y'all saw the beginning video and you saw me like chopping it up a little bit. I actually already wore this wig. I wore it out for one of my close friend's birthday and oh my god, I felt so fly. I feel like we just looked so bomb that day. <laughs> I had already shaped it a bit before I came on camera today, but I trimmed it some more. The way I work with kinky curly hair, I could cut this wig up for a good like 45 minutes and just keep chopping it because I just have such a good time with it. But I'm, I'm going to keep my hands out of it for now because I like this. One thing I like about this wig is the fact that it comes with bangs. And that's not something I would normally see with synthetic wigs. Normally I would have to create the bangs myself. So that's like one extra step that I didn't really have to do. But as far as the layering, that's where you're going to have to put in some more work. Please do not wear these wigs straight out the pack, y'all. I, I beg you, please do not do that. Put some time into shaping your kinky curly wigs. Trust me, okay? Remember, the price point is under $30. For that price, I'm not expecting a fully customized unit out the pack. I know what I'm getting myself into and I've done this a ton of times before. You can definitely check out some older videos where I've, you know, chopped up wigs and shown you how to do it. But as far as a tip, I will definitely say like when you are cutting your hair into layers, right? What I like to do is I will stretch out the bottom a bit and then just snip a little bit off at a time just to see where it falls. So I know for me, I want my curls to fall somewhere a little past the collarbone area and that's what I did. As I get up here, I'm still cutting, like I'm not cutting all the way up here, y'all. I'm cutting still at the bottom and I'm inching my way towards the length that I desire. And if you want this type of look, simply just twist the wig. Like when I was wearing the wig forwards, it looked, I don't know, it wasn't giving. So when I twisted it to the side like this, I was feeling it. And normally I like when my kinky curly wigs are kind of like part on the right side, but this left side, it's hitting. Let me know in the comments if you agree with me. I'm really loving this. Like the color, you know, the curl pattern is very pretty. It definitely reminds me of like a 3B, 3C type of curl. But yeah, the color is giving. This is like a beautiful 30 color. And if you look on Amazon, you will see tons of color options 
for this wig. You'll definitely see a 1B, the darker, a darker brown than this, like, like maybe a 430 almost. You'll see like a 27, you'll see platinum, you'll see blue, purple, red. I'm telling you, it's all there. So if you're into some funky colors, you'll definitely find that with this unit. Literally all, I have no complaints. I've worn this out once already. I'm definitely gonna wear it out again and again. And I feel like this is one of those wigs that the older it gets, the better it looks. That's what I love about natural textured units because I just feel like with time, it just ages like fine wine. You know what I'm saying? Like we all are. Hello? Do you see me in this wig? And this melanin popping. Mm. Who is she? <laughs> I don't even have any jewelry on and I'm just feeling wonderful right now. So highly recommend this wig. No complaints, 10 out of 10. If you're willing to put in some work to customize it, I think you'll be very happy with this unit. I know it's summertime and some of you are probably wondering like, oh, is it hot on your head? I mean, I wore it out for like eight hours and I felt fine. Honestly, me feeling hot in a wig doesn't deter me from wearing it because if I love it, your girl's just gonna be hot. <laughs> pretty much it but this does have a very breathable and ventilated cap as you saw in the beginning so you shouldn't have any problems and also I definitely recommend you check out this new wig group that I recently purchased I don't have it on right now because honestly I lost it and I really need to find it <laughs> I lost it while doing the video with C and definitely check out that video y'all if you want to see some like more affordable headband wigs I did like nine wigs in that video but in that video I did show y'all the adjustable wig grip which I think is a great find. So I'll have it linked down below. And anything that you see in this video will be linked down below. So if you love loving this hair, feel free to shop through my Amazon links. And remember when you shop through my links, you are supporting is that your hair, which allows me to continue to put out these videos for you. So thank you so, so much for everyone who shops through my Amazon storefront. Now before we go, can I show y'all my dress real quick? Because I'm loving this dress. I'm sure a lot of y'all have seen it already. This is a dress that I also bought from Amazon and it's a cutout dress. It is definitely, sh <laughs> it's showing quite a bit. So if you need a bold summer dress, this is the dress for you. There's cutouts on the side. Your back is out. It's a low showing back as well. I'm wearing a size medium. I, I, I absolutely love it. So if you want to tap into your sexy, I definitely suggest you check this dress out because I have already bought it in three colors. I have it in this rust color, I have it in yellow, and I have it in black. I would say as far as the sizing, medium seems to work best for me. I tried the black in a small just because I wanted the bottom part to fit just a tad bit tighter. And it did, but then my boobs felt like it was spilling out. So I'm gonna stick with the medium. If you need my measurements, they'll be in the description box. If you're close to my size, definitely go with the medium. If you have a larger breast than I do, like, you know, double, triple D, you know, I don't know about this right here. It's not giving me that much support because it's not like it's adjustable straps, you know what I mean? So yeah, I kind of wish my, my breast would just sit up like this. <laughs> in this dress but i'm fine with it like this i think i look good i have way more coming because i am doing an amazon mid-size haul it will be dropping this week so be on the lookout for that video i'm so excited to share these finds because i've been just collecting these summer items literally since <laughs> may and i'm finally getting around to putting them all together and doing a huge haul for you all so i hope all of you can join me for that premiere but yes y'all overall let me know how you feel about this wig is it something that you would rock this summer going into fall it's already about to be august which i cannot believe like what where did the time go let me know how your summer is going definitely include that when you drop me a comment after this video because i like to chit chat with y'all overall my summer is going pretty well i am traveling soon again I'm going on my first solo trip. What? I'm so excited. I tried to do a solo trip before, like a few birthdays ago, and then my friend ended up like joining me, so it wasn't really a solo trip because I was with her the whole time. But this time, I'm like for real doing it by myself. I'm going to a women's conference called Innovative Income Summit, and I'm super excited because one of my favorite podcasters is hosting it. So, death no, I'll be filming and vlogging all that. Speaking of the vlogs, yeah. <laughs> I need some encouragement. I am letting my perfectionism 
get in the way of just doing it. Like seriously y'all, I've been stressing over these freaking vlogs. So can y'all just do me a favor and just type down below, Gladys, get it the fuck together, get these vlogs out because you wanna see. Because if I know that y'all want the content, it, it pushes me a little bit more. And I know a lot of y'all know I've been going through ups and downs with my mood and whatever. Y'all have been sending a lot of encouragement my way, so thank you for that, I really appreciate it. But you know, it's, it's time for me to pick myself up and get this content out for y'all because I love to do it and y'all love it too. If you are new here, make sure you tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. And if you wanna see some of my latest videos, check them out over here to the right of me. Thank y'all so much for joining me today. I love y'all and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.